Hey guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be comparing two Dior lipsticks and this has been a highly requested video. A lot of you guys have been asking which one is better. So I'll be comparing the Dior Addict Lip Tint, comparing it with the Rouge Dior Forever Liquid. Which one is more long lasting, which one is better, which is more hydrating, the price, all these shades available. If you guys are new to my channel, please subscribe and follow me on Instagram. But further ado, let's get started with today's video. So before I do start today's video, I want to mention that I'm going to have a Dior card order giveaway very soon. It's going to start on July 2nd with my friend Fabulous Irene. So don't forget to subscribe to both our channels. I'm super excited and I cannot wait for this giveaway. I haven't done a card order giveaway in a while, so I'm very happy about that. So, today's video, I'll be comparing two Dior lipsticks. They are in different shades, but basically comparing, like, the moisture, the moisture, which is more long-lasting, and which one I recommend. So, let's start off with the Dior Addict Lip Tint. This one is a brand new one. They used to have a Dior Addict Lip Tint as well, um, but I guess they kind of changed the packaging, the formula, and also the um, lipstick, like, brush applicator itself which I will show in a little bit so the Dior Addict lip tint let me show you guys the packaging of it this is how it looks it says Dior right here and yeah just hot pink all around it will be different color depending on uh, which shade you get so the Dior Addict lip tint is $35 and it has 12 shades available the shade that I have here is number 761, which is Natural Fuchsia. It's a hot pink, which I love so much. So all the shades available, we have a Natural Peach, Natural Nude, Natural Tea, Natural Coral, Natural Rosewood, Natural Sienna, Natural Poppy, Natural Red Tangerine, Natural Rose, Natural Ginger, Natural Fuchsia, and Natural Berry. And online, it says that it is hydrating, transfer-proof lip tint, 95% natural origin ingredients, and long wear. So it is 5 milliliters for $35. And basically, <clears throat> I made three points about this lipstick. It is hydrating, it is transfer-proof, and long-lasting. So, the other one, I will talk back on this the lipstick, but let me tell you guys about the other one now. So, this one is the Rouge Dior Forever Liquid. Um, previously, there were only 11 shades, but now they just came out with new collections, so there is new shades. Now, they have a total of 17 shades available. And this one is $39, and it has 6 milliliters. Online, it says it is Transfer Proof Liquid Lipstick Ultra Pigmented Matte and weightless comfort so it is transfer proof and matte um, but the thing is in my opinion even though it says that the Rouge Forever is matte um, I think this one is more hydrating than the Attic lips, uh, Lip Tint this one says it's hydrating but to be honest once I blot my lips with like a napkin that way it's all matte it actually dries off like kind of dry so if you do want a moisturizing lipstick then I recommend the Rouge Dior uh, Forever Liquid um, so now let me actually swatch it for you guys so you can see how it looks so here is the lipstick applicator for the Dior Addict Lip Tint it is very thin and it is very very soft as well so this is how the applicator looks it is thin that way you can get like the the, um, what do you call this? Like the insides of your lips, all the way on the sides. Um, and also the applicator is very, very soft and very, very bendy as well. So let me go ahead and swatch this for you guys. But yeah, this is how it looks. It is very wet when it goes on. But let me just let it dry off. So let me put swatch the other one as well. This applicator is much bigger. And it's kind of like a sponge applicator in a way. Here is how it looks. So this side looks like it picks up all the lipstick. And then this is the other side. But it still works either way. So let's swatch it. 
Yep, here are the colors. It's a really, really beautiful, like, um, like a nude, kind of like a mauve as well. So here are the two shades up close. And I'm just going to let it dry a little bit. Usually what I do is I apply it on my lip. <clears throat> then I grab like a little tissue and I would blot my lipstick on there. That way it would dry off faster. So I'm just going to let it dry a little bit. These are my hands. Um, but these are so beautiful. Normally what I do for this one is I just apply it on, blot, and that's it. But for this one, because it doesn't really dry off as easy as the lip addict, I have to apply it like two to three times that way the color will stay because even though it said it is transfer proof, it actually can go off. Like if I were to get a tissue and I would wipe my lipstick, my lips, it would go off. So if you want a long lasting long lasting lipstick, I would get the Dior Addict. Like I love this lipstick. I wear this so many times. If you do food videos, I recommend this one because your lipstick will not go off. So I let it dry for quite a while now, but it is still a little bit wet. I'm going to get a tissue, and I'm actually going to pat it down first. Just going to pat it. That way all the wetness will go onto the tissue. Just patting it, and then lifting. So, it did go off because it didn't dry all the way yet, but also because it was still wet. So this is how it looks like when I get the wetness off my hands. Okay, now I'm going to grab a tissue and let's see the difference when I try to rub it off. See which one is more long lasting. So here is the Addict, here is the Rouge Forever Liquid. Wiping it and they kind of look the same honestly, but let's see. I'm going to wipe it really hard so you guys can see how it looks. Really, really hard. Let's see which one lasts better. Okay, so here is the final result. Basically, the liquid, um, Forever Liquid kind of disappeared. It's just kind of like a stain on my hand. But the Lip Addict, it stays on way better. I'm like rubbing it, and this is how it looks. But for me, overall, I honestly recommend and love the Dior Addict Lip Tint more. Um, it just stays on better, and when I'm using a makeup remover, it's like still staying on my lips. Like my lips will still be pink until like the next morning. It is super long lasting. If you were to get a makeup remover and use this one, it will go off. Like you won't even see it anymore. So yeah, honestly, if you just want like something more long lasting, get the Addict. But if you're looking for something um, more matte, um, then I'll get this one. But overall, I don't think I will be repurchasing the Forever one. I don't like it as much. I really do love the addict. I highly recommend getting this one. So yeah, those are my opinion. Um, hopefully this video was helpful. Kind of said the same thing over and over again. Hopefully <laughs> it was helpful. Um, but yeah, those are the swatches. They are very matte. Um, but honestly, the lip tint, the addict lip tint is way better. It comes with 12 shades. You got like a variety of like nudes. You got pinks. You got mauves, red, oranges. Um, but I really do love this fuchsia color. It's very nice. If you guys have any questions, any video suggestions, please do leave them down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. A giveaway is coming up very, very soon. Follow me on Instagram as well. Maybe you guys want to check out my Patreon. I'll link it down below. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!